You know what a sad sight is? That. But do you know what's a better sight? This Blackstone 22 inch electric tabletop griddle. Let's do a little first impression and unboxing. got our hands on the Blackstone electric griddle. Uh, you know what? The two burner is new for this year compared to the uh, 17 inch from uh, last year, which is only a single burner. So go big or go home. This comes with the, uh, the griddle cart here. So I do not plan on using the griddle cart. We're going to put it together just to see how it is. Um, we're not going to go super in depth on the unboxing here and beat a dead horse like some people have already around the internet. So let's take a look. Here we got directions. Ah, here's our tray and everything. So we'll get to that. Since now we got that out, this is taking too long. Let's get right to it. That's still not right. Now we got this out at least. So taking a quick look at this before we actually put it on. All right, guys, just a little tip when you're assembling the uh, griddle cart is that while you're in step number two, you'll see that at the bottom here, You'll see we are putting these little M6 uh, the, the square nuts that are supposed to slide in so you can put your uh, secure your leg. So they tell you to do that with the, I guess these would be the front here on both sides. And you'll see if I can zoom in. You'll see right there they have you putting the M6 bolts in right there and over here, which is uh, pictured right here in step number three and step number four. So, they give you 10 of these in total. So, three go on that right there, two go right there, but then they don't tell you where to put the other uh, five. So, if you haven't figured it out, put the M6 ones right here, right here, right here, and then there's two more that go right there. So, looking at the picture, do the same thing in step number three right there, put it right where it says in number two. Do the same exact thing and do the same thing over here, what you see in four. So just to make sure that is all secured properly. I don't know why they don't show you in the directions. Maybe I'm missing something and if I am, uh, please let me know. But all right, let's try this one more time. That's better. All right. So assembly not too bad for the griddle cart itself uh directions are kind of crap uh you're better off just looking at the uh photo lining everything up other than that it's not the end of the world so little uh side shelf here um one thing that a lot of people i see are getting confused is if you look into the box it says standard cutting board onto the uh like the side um so if you look carefully it says where does it say cutting board sold separately it says it right there it looks like they put a sticker on cutting board sold separately so um <clears throat> that is why there's no cutting board on here but this little side shelf kind of just comes up and then i don't know it's it's flimsy i i wouldn't use it um but you have a little like uh put all your seasonings in there and two little trays i guess you can put whatever you want in there again i am not using this uh for uh the purposes of the griddle cart here i'm going to be just using the griddle itself on my kitchen counter so i'll get a video with that uh soon hopefully but other than that, this thing is pretty big. The box and pictures do not do justice. I don't even think this video, as I'm looking at it through my phone right now, does this thing justice. So it is pretty big. Um, you can see here, uh, yeah, nice grease tray. This is pretty cool. I know this is something little, but they give you a little, little handle for your finger right there just to get the grease tray out. But other than that, just remember, this is not cast iron, so you are not going to be using any, like, metal utensils, uh, like the spatulas and stuff, uh, like you would for the Pro Series that's over there or any other griddle stuff. So you got to use wood or plastic, um, just like you would your 
um, griddle that you probably have in your kitchen that's uh, 20 years old. But uh, this is awesome. I cannot wait to get this going. But thank you guys for watching. Please check us out at realamericanoutdoors.com. Uh, check us out on Facebook. Please subscribe to the our YouTube channel here and give us a like and a comment if you like this video. We are coming up with, to first ice soon. As you can see, we got all the ice fishing stuff over there. So I am pumped for that. Uh, and uh, hopefully, like I said, we'll get a I made a first cook on this or at least an impression on here. So uh, thank you for watching. We'll catch you guys next time.